Hello guys, this time I will review the Flycam MJX Bug 20 EIS. EIS, Electronic Image Stabilization. With this feature, it will be automatically repair frame by frame. So, the image and video spatial of this Flycam will be more smooth. Let's review together and see what is the advantage and disadvantages of this flycam. Hi guys, let's open the box and see what is the content. Transmitter or remote control One set propellers The bolt Another set propellers This for backup And screwdriver This is the main quadcopter. Right? See the box very small. So for easy to bring and fast using flycam, we need to buy the bag. Let's install the propellers. Carefully one install the propellers need to check the position follow the manual instruction. This is what will be happen if we install the propellers on wrong position. The fry cam will be summer sound. Install the propellers. Tighten with the screwdriver. Install memory card. Install battery AA to the transmitter or controller. Insert battery to flycam. Then turn on the flycam with long press button. Turn on the transmitter. Transmitter and flycam connected. Calibration sign appear. We need to do calibration. Rotate the flycam with horizontal direction until the lamps turn into green. Then rotating with vertical direction until the lamps change into red and yellow. Okay, fly cam was ready. The calibration sign already disappeared in transmitter. Start the engine, press the lock button. If we not press the fly button, it will be automatically stopped by itself. Turning the camera. Time to put the cell phone on the transmitter. This flycam using Wi-Fi 5 
AC connection. We should check our handphone support or not to connecting with the Flycam Wi-Fi. Make sure our cell phone have this Wi-Fi network information. If no, we need to buy the new one, guys. AC means that the router has support for Wi-Fi 5, wireless networking standard, which offers fast Wi-Fi network connections on the 5G edge shed frequency. Go to Play Store and install MRC Pro. Run the application. Handphone still not connected. We need to connect handphone with the fly cam. If before already connected, need to remove and make new connection. Choose the drone Wi-Fi. Just don't ask again for this network and yes. Run the application again. Yes, here we are. Great. Do zoom in and zoom out. Choose setting camera. Choose camera resolution. Setting the brightness. Okay guys, let's try to fly indoor. Turn off the GPS. Press up down button. Let packing and go outside guys. Remember to turn on the GPS guys and do calibration again before flight. Every time change the battery or after turn on the flight cap it should need to do calibration. I'm not sure, sometimes the flycam light is not turn red and yellow when do vertical calibration, but turn on red and green. But it's okay to fly, let's do this. After press unlock button to start the engine, press up down button to fly. It's windy guys, but it's okay. Don't worry. Turn left. Turn right. Up.
and done. Or what? Backward. Leftward. Right one. Long press button. Okay. Long press button if you want to change the speed. Okay, let's try the follow me mode. Press the multi-function button. This appear three kind of multi-function. Follow me, orbit flight, and headless mode. Follow me mode. Okay, let's move. I think we can not only just walk, maybe run. This fly can try to follow me. It's great. But now. Let's try orbit fly. Also choose the multi function, choose the orbit fly and then swipe. Okay, fly cam, fly, follow the orbit. Headless mode. In the headless mode, it will change the right stick controller. We can control forward, backward, leftward, and rightward without understand the fly cam direction. Sometimes, if the distance was too far or too high, we cannot see clearly how the fly cam direction. So, with this mode, we can control without thinking the fly cam direction the fly cam will move forward backward leftward and rightward based on our position this is the multi-function Headless and swipe. Then we can just moving the controller to left, right, forward, backward. Off. GPS tracking mode. Press the map on the monitor. So the map will be appear 
with the flycam position and also remote controller position it should be on this monitor can change with the satellite mode but why the satellite mode cannot be appear maybe the network connection is not good okay let's just try to drawing the tracking here yeah okay just submit swipe now the fly cam fly following the track that's great Continue flight, follow the track. It's running in the low battery. Okay, let's finish it. Okay, done. Nightfall, guys. The video is not too clear. Anyway, let's continue test the fly cap. I want to try how far and heck this fly cabin can fly. Distance. Hey. Let's fly more far. See the distance and hike here. Fifty five meter distance and seventy seven meter height. One hundred thirty meter. One hundred ninety. Two hundred meter, two hundred sixty five, three hundred meter,
325 meter 330 Try to look around TX no signal warning appear Flycam will return home automatically See the return home marking beeping It's returning to home position He's back. I'm happy with him. Him? Do short press on the like button to turn on. Time to back home guys It's dark Another day with him I can do a little play with him He doesn't want to have far from me <laughs> Seem like I have a pet. <laughs> 